Hi everyone, welcome to the Coach's Corner. I'm your host, Scott Wagner, and today we are talking about softball. Uh, this is our first softball show. The season just started a few weeks ago, and joining us today is Sarah Pellegrine, Brittany Hyatt, and head coach Bob Allen. Uh, welcome to the show, Sarah. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Thank you for having me. No problem. Uh, Sarah's a pitcher for West Virginia State. Uh, I uh, just want to, first of all, just kind of introduce yourself a little bit and uh, how you came to West Virginia State. Well, I'm from Hopedale, Ohio. It's near Steubenville. No one really knows where it's at from here. <laughs> um, my summer coaches were real heavy in getting me recruited. They like wanted me to go play softball after high school. And then Bob just randomly saw my tape and I guess wanted me to come for a visit and I liked it, so I decided to come. Now, uh, last year, uh, you know, you came into a whole new team, new coaching staff. Uh, just talk a little bit about Coach Allen and the, the rest of the coaching staff and uh, what it's like to play for him. Well, of course when Bob and Nip and Carrie and all them are trying to get us to come here, they're all serious and everything. But then, like, you get to know them and they're a bunch of goofballs. Like, they're fun <laughs> to be around. Um, but they're serious at the same time. They want to get the work done, and I don't know. They're good coaches. I like them. Uh, you you got thrown into action a lot last year as a, as a freshman. Uh, you're uh, in the pitching rotation. I know uh, last year you said there was only two pitchers or three pitchers, but uh, two main ones. Uh, so just what was that like kind of being thrown in there and uh, pitching as much as you did last year as a freshman? Well, I definitely didn't expect all that coming here because Bob had said I was also getting recruited for kind of like second base too. So I wasn't expecting to pitch as much as I did. And then we started off with a whole bunch of pitchers and we lost a lot from the fall to the spring. And it ended up just being me and two other girls. And then me and Kelsey, another freshman last year, we just ended up taking over and doing all the pitching eventually. So what was uh, your freshman experience? Uh, you know, you get come to college and uh, you're throwing in, you're playing all the time. You got a lot of practice balancing that with school. How was that for you last year? Um, it was definitely a lot of getting used to with balancing it with school. But um, I made it work as best as I could. Um, I don't know. Was... Yeah. Now, uh, you finished in sixth place last year. I know uh, y'all were, I mean, it was a strong finish, uh, you know, near the top of the conference, but I know y'all were disappointed uh, with last year. Yeah, we should have went a little bit farther in the conference tournament. Um, we, we played good games at conference. It's just they ended up lopsided, not towards us, so. Uh, the Wiviac is historically very strong for softball. It's a very strong softball conference, and uh, you got a taste of that last year. How tough is it day in and day out playing in conference? It's, it is tough, and like every team is practicing. We practice every day except one day out of the week, and now we're going to be going on spring break, playing 19 games in nine days, which is going to be a lot, but we go on the spring break and we play teams to get ready for our conference and we play all of our conference teams after spring break and by then we're ready to play ball and give them some good games. Uh, you know uh, West Virginia Wesleyan has been a team they've won several championships over the last 10 years or so they uh, they're pretty much a powerhouse in this conference uh, and they've played a lot of games already uh, just as that a team that you look forward to seeing down the road? Yeah they're actually they're actually the last team on our schedule to play, and hopefully by that time we'll be ready to play them. I think we will. I don't think I think they're a very strong team, but I also think they're very beatable, and I think we'll have a good chance against them. What What do you think are the biggest rivals for West Virginia State uh, in the Wiviac? You see, definitely we. It's always like scratching till the end of the game, wanting to beat them. Last year we didn't get we didn't beat them, but they were two really good games, but. They're definitely our rivals, but I mean, it's a rival with every school, really. We want to beat everyone, so. Yeah, now, uh, from last year, now you go into this year, y'all have played three games so far this spring. Uh, it, did, did any difference in the way you, if your role changed for going from freshman to sophomore, maybe more expected out of you? Yeah, maybe, and there's also, like we had more pitch, we have more pitchers this year, so not everything will be heavily put on Kelsey and I to do all the pitching. So we have 
we have more people now. And yeah, there's more expected of me because I have a year under my belt now, but I'll try to live up to whatever's thrown at me. What about, I know this is a very confident team, what about the expectations of the team this year? Uh, Preseason, you're projected to finish fourth in the conference. Uh, so what are the kind of team's own expectations on themselves? Um, our expectation is always to win conference. That's what like we want to. That's our main goal. I think our coaches want that to be our goal as well. And mainly, like we're just we just want to win as many as we can and play ball as a team. Now there's a there's a lot of returners on this year's team. Uh, didn't lose a whole lot of players from last year. Uh, what's that like to have all that experience coming back? It's got to add to that confidence. Yeah, we're pretty much, other than we lost one senior last season, other than that, we pretty much have the same field out there. And it's like they know their positions, they're comfortable with them, and it'll turn out pretty good, I think. Now, you've had a lot of games canceled due to weather. What's that like? You know, in softball, you know, it kind of comes with, you know, it's part of the game where, you know, if there's bad weather, you can't play. But... Uh, what's that like? There's other teams that have played 20 games already. Uh, Y'all are two and one right now. So what's that like to kind of, you know, have to sit and wait to get to your bulk of your season going? It's it's irritating, like getting ready to play and like that day before practice when you're just pumped to play and then you get a call and it's like you're rained out and it's it's just irritating and we're ready to play. We're tired of practicing and we're just ready to play. Well, we look forward to seeing you play. Thank you Thank so you. much for coming on. All right, we're going to take a break. Uh, sit tight. We will be right back with star shortstop Brittany Hyatt uh, here on the Coach's Corner. 